my channel. Today I'm going to do a little bit of a review on this lovely gal right here. I've had this wig quite a while now. Um, I would say probably like three months or more and I've actually washed it a couple times as well and the, the fibers are staying great on it so I kind of wanted to just do a quick review or mini review I should say. I'm not the greatest at reviews but I think it's important for like an everyday person who like this wig was not gifted to me I bought it with my own money um, I bought this wig um, on Facebook from a group called the Beauty Nook which I'll link down below Leanne does a live sale a live open box sale every Friday at 8 p.m. so you can get really good deals on wigs also she's doing a new thing called meet it or beat it where if you see a coupon code on another wig site she will meet that price and beat it so you can't if you're looking to buy wigs I would highly suggest in joining that group I'll leave it linked below I'll also leave the Facebook page linked below as well but anyway let's just start with this wig this wig is called blazing star and it's from Sintress now I believe that Tress Allure is going to be taking over the Sintress gem Tress brand if, if I'm wrong about that someone please say so in the comments but I believe that they are taking over uh, this brand um, and the, the these fibers are great they are patented synthetic hair fibers they're created to have the consistency of human hair it's a special blend of fibers they have the closest look and feel to human hair and and they actually do the, the fibers are great on this and like I just washed this wig the other day and it's it's just a wonderful wig the color I'm wearing is um, 1621 it's called glazed sand um, and let me let me adjust a little bit here I have just put a new I'm using the wig fix wig grip I'm trying to use it and it seems a little bit off for me but we'll go over that some other time so there's three tones in here they're saying it's a pale blonde a golden blonde and light blonde and then it's a frosted top and sides with even blending of colors on the back and the sides so I find that it does have as you can see the coloring up here um the colors of this of their wigs now I don't this is the only one I have of theirs but the highlights remind me a lot of Raquel Welch because it seems like there's a lot of lighter colors that go right along that kind of frame your face um so, so it kind of, her, the colors of this kind of remind me of like a Raquel Welch wig. The length of this goes from 11 to 7. I don't, I couldn't find the weight of this wig, but if I had to guess, it would probably be between between five and six ounces. It's very light for a long wig. Um, these, the Sintress wigs are ideal for medical loss hair clients as well as clients that want minimum care and upkeep. This is not heat heat friendly. Um, but I, I just really love the fibers. This wig for me, I feel like there's a lot of hair like kind of up here, or maybe even a little bit of permatease like right back here. It's not really permatease. I just, I don't know if if it's just a lot of hair right here, but it, it kind of gives it like a little bit of a poof effect, which, you know, I don't really hate. I, I seem to be into these long, like straight styles lately though. So um, there is, it is hand tied in the front. There is a double mono top and a lace front and let me show you I'll try and get as close in as I can that's the lace front it's you know I don't have it glued down or anything um but it's very realistic I think um you know it goes all the way over to here I hope you can see that <laughs> and then here it is again and so you can um, part this any way you want I have it on a left side part but if I can try you could easily part this on the right side as well. So there is a right side part. I'm kind of a left side part gal, but so here it is on the right side. And like I said, I've washed this, I've worn, actually I've worn this quite a bit. I usually wear this wig on weekends, um, like when I go out and stuff or, you know, I usually use leave my shorter wigs for work because I wear them every day for like eight hours. And sorry if I keep looking over here, guys. I know the camera's over here, but this camera's different than my other one, so I'm trying to get it figured out. It's actually my phone, I should say. So the cap is considered average, small to average, I believe, with a 21 and a half circumference. My head is 21.25 um, circumference. However, with that being said, 
these are very very stretchy caps like very stretchy like like I can pull this back I can lift it down I can lift it off I, I feel like someone with a larger head than mine could definitely wear this with no problem um, the ear tabs have metal stays in them which is nice so you can kind of you know push them in um, and then this is my bio hair it's almost kind of the same color as this so I sometimes will take some of this hair back and like tuck it back like that so it's you can easily like tuck your hair back with this wig I think it's really pretty and the lace front is really nice like and you can see these highlights like I said they're very Raquel Welch where you know it's like lighter around the face um so again it's a hand tied double mono top and the rest of the unit is machine made with weft so the back is wefting and then you have the lace front so whoops got my necklace there so this would be her from the right side trying to get the length it's quite long in the back here's the back and then I'll turn around this way sorry my chair is creaking guys here is it from the left side and it's very very pretty please all the way down to here probably about the middle of my back if not further I'm only five foot two or five three so you know longer wigs come down pretty pretty long on me so yeah, I, I love this wig. I think it's really pretty. Also, I did wash this in the um, Aesthetica Wet Line shampoo and conditioner, which I highly, highly recommend. And Leanne also sells that. Um, she, I think she gives, I think she has four products for $40 or it's three for 40. I, I can't remember. I think you can buy the whole Wet Line from her for $40. But she can hook you up. So you need to check out the Facebook group. Check out the lives. You know, if you're interested in wigs or, or, you know, you're, you know, she can make you a really good deal and get you a good price on some wigs. So, I, she carries most brands too. So that's really nice. And the and the group is very informative and supportive. Really great group of girls. And we talk about makeup and all kinds of things. So there's other things happening in the group too that are very exciting. They're upcoming. So. If you want to check those out, definitely check out the group. Leave it. I'll leave it linked below. And again, this is Sintress Blazing Star. And again, I think Tressalore is taking over this brand. So I'm not sure how that's working out. I believe it's Tressalore. And again, if somebody, if I'm wrong, please someone correct me. But yeah, this is Blazing Star. I actually have a, I bought another one of these from a wig sister so I could have a backup. But like I said, I've, I've had this one at least three or four months and look at I mean the ends are not even uh, this hair is really really good Tressalor has very good fibers like I'm I, I'm super impressed with Tressalor fibers and I'm also super impressed with like Noriko fibers they last forever it's like a workhorse <laughs> that will last you for a very long time but yeah it's just like even just feeling this hair it, it feels like real human hair there's actually there's no um, shininess to it or anything like that it just looks like really pretty hair and it, it fits me really well too like the ear tabs come right up to the side of my head right here so but again the lace front is super nice I hope you guys can see it and it's just overall a really pretty wig I, I would actually maybe get one or two of these in a different shade um, maybe lighter maybe even darker for fall but again, this one is color 1621. They call it glazed sand. It runs a little bit, to me it runs a little bit on the cool side, but you can see the warmth in it because it says it has pale blonde, golden blonde, and light brown, and then it's frosted around the top and the sides, which I think that's pretty true. Like I said, it kind of reminds me of Raquel Welch with the, you know, where it's frosted around your face, or it highlights your face, which is very nice, so... But anyways, guys, I know this is kind of a short video, um, but you know, I just wanted to give you my opinion on this wig. Oh, you know what? Actually, before I sign off, I'll show you the inside of the cap. Let's do that. Let me take it off and I'll show you the inside of the cap. Okay, because I feel like a lot of people like to see the inside of the caps. So this has somewhat of an extended nape here, and there's, this is covered in like a fabric. It almost feels kind of plasticky, but it's not plastic. It's... I'm not sure, but it's very nice, whatever material this is right here. It has the Velcro straps, and then here are the ear tabs, and they're covered in like a velvet line. 
and then here's your double mono top and it has the silicone strip um, if you don't have hairs this would be very very comfortable for you here's the lace front ear tabs again open wefted back and as you can see this cap is super stretchy look at that super stretchy cap so I honestly think someone with a larger size head could wear this cap and again there's the lace front again very pretty lace front and then it has the vel yeah I'm sure I said this but it has these velcro closures so let me put her back on and boom <laughs> there she is so I, re I really like this wig she's out of control now because I had her flipped over but some girls like big hair you know us born us who lived through the 80s and 90s we don't mind a little big hair don't we right you know what I'm saying those ra rave hairspray days aquanet <laughs> white snake concerts you know what I'm talking about so anyways hope you guys like this video if you're new here please like and subscribe I'd be happy to have you I'm hoping to upload some more wig reviews coming up and again please please visit Leanne's group she is a great person she's very helpful and she can give you the best price on a wig that you're interested in on her lives if you I think it would be best if you're new to that group watch one live first to kind of see how that works they use the comment sold uh, I don't want to say application but the comment sold format for selling so you know you'll have to type in what you see up at the top of the screen as they're selling it and then if you know it, it doesn't mean you can't get the wig you can always buy the wig you just have to message their Facebook page but you'll see how it works guys believe me and I got hair all over my face now <laughs> but anyways guys please check out the group and if you like this wig run out and get it it's certainly long I know it's a little bit longer than some people like but it's really beautiful I I've, I've worn this several several times in fact if you're ever on my Facebook page i this is the wig I'm wearing in my profile pic but thank you so much for watching my video I really appreciate it and I hope you're all having a great day